What is up, guys? I'm Daddy Gamer Fred, and welcome back to another episode of Live Reaction Review. Today, we're going to be watching the State of Play for Wednesday, February 2nd. What the fuck are you talking about, man? I have February 2nd there. Damn it. It's not February 2nd. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock. <laughs> it's March 9th. I have the, the, the image of February right here. Uh, excuse that. Year 2043. the android. I'd like to share today's dinosaur forecast. Dinosaur? A dinosaur outbreak will soon occur. Residents in the affected what? area have been evacuated. And a team what is of this? fighters has been dispatched. Can I turn off the... Some, there we go. Please remain indoors. Bro, what is this? They just starting it from the gate? Please don't be a futuristic dino crisis. I will be upset. Oh my god. Second thought, I won't be upset. That actually looks fire. <laughs> what the fuck? Hey, what? This is This is a futuristic dino crisis? No fucking way, right? No fucking way. You've been planning a chance to wreck this for two years. All I wanted was to be IBS's top pilot. IBS's latest dinosaur Ooh. forecasts add exocene technology. Exocene technology. This is like a live service dinosaur fighting horde game. Yep. With mech suits. Capcom, don't play with our heart like this, bro. Come on, bro. Oh wow. Capcom, you can't Bro, what the fuck? <laughs> Yo, Capcom, why are you doing this with dinosaurs? Like I guess that looks fire. But give us a dino crisis, please. And I swear, if they say dino crisis, I swear. <laughs> I'm gonna scream. Okay. What? Explore Primal? What was that? Another oh, that's a dope. Recruit, right? Welcome to Ivius. What's up? 2023, PS4, PS5. Okay. Next year. Play returns with more announcements and updates that, for your favorite games. That looks like an okay game. We just saw the debut uh, of Exo Primal, a brand new Exo IP from Primal. Primal. It hits PS4 and PS5 next year. Okay. Next Exo up, let's get Primal. Some popping updates for some fan Ghostwire launching soon. Okay. I'm glad that they're getting Ghostwire out of the way. Exo Primal looks cool, but I don't know. This is like if Yakuza was a first person Dead Stranding game. <laughs> I'm not, no. <laughs> I gotta play Resident Evil before I do all this. Face the unknown. My man is Spider-Man. I don't know how I feel about Ghostwire Tokyo. I, I may skip it until later, but it's one of those like mid games that I, I don't know. This is Final Fantasy, right? That Final Fantasy, uh, I forget what it's called, but it's an action focused Final Fantasy. Very Devil May Cry S Final Fantasy Origin. New veil. Oh, demo available today. Let's try it then. Later today, visit PlayStation Store to download a new demo for Stranger okay. of Paradise. Final Stranger Fantasy of Origin. Paradise. Let's do it. We could try it. Now, let's jump into the world of Forspoken. Forspoken. All new gameplay. It got delayed to um, uh, October, if I believe. I haven't seen Spoken. anything gameplay wise, so. Yeah. And uh, everything I think we did. to kill you, kind of way. I think we did, or maybe it was just a big cutscene, but then I don't remember seeing anything that was like straight gameplay, gameplay stuff. Oh my God, this looks fire. Okay. 
This looks actually pretty fucking good. The world looks too big for whatever reason. I guess it's a big fight. It's a big fight. It's big fights going on. Okay. Okay. Oh, surfing. Oh, I thought those were the NPCs she was jumping towards. That's what bothers me about this game. Like, I, like that she looks insane. But let's finish this. Can we see some towns, NPCs, and shit? Like, you know, a lot of people might say that's boring, but that's, you know, that's fun to me too. I want to be in a world that's living, not a world that's like, you know. I don't know. It's like Elden Ring to me. I gotta try Elden Ring, but you know. That was a new look at the sprawling PS5 adventure for Spoken from Luminous Productions. Let's check out some. It doesn't look like my bag. In Gundam Evolution. Gundam Evolution. Coming to PS4 and PS5 later I, this year. Oh, I, for some strange reason, I thought they were gonna say <laughs> straight to PlayStation Now. This seems like a PlayStation Now game. Oh God, this music is terrible. Oh my god, and it looks terrible too. Sorry. Welcome to the oh, do not say welcome to the battlefield. Especially after that battlefield game. <laughs> you have nothing to do with battlefield, but don't say battlefield. You should have said welcome to the war zone. <laughs> Three competitive game modes. Oh, so it's like Halo. <laughs> okay. So what's so funny? Like Halo and Call of Duty. <laughs> oh no, man. Oh no, man. This looks like it may be fun for a night or a stream, but I can't see myself getting too sucked into this. Pause. Gundam, not like this, bro. Not like this. Not like this. It don't matter what you show at the end, bro. It don't matter what you show at the end. Okay. If we could try it for free, I'll try it. You know? Turtles! The collection? What? Oh! GBA? The, um... The GBA with the NES and the Super Nintendo one. Oh! With the fighting game one, too! Okay! This might be worth a pickup, bro. This for the um tournament fighters. Okay. How many games, bro? Damn. Oh. The Cowabunga collection. Okay. 2022 Konami still still curling along there, Konami. What the fuck is this? Some kangaroos. What use? Not reflective of gameplay. I want a Pokemon game like this. <laughs> Give me a Pokemon side game where I could be Charizard in a um coming I mean, <laughs> What the fuck is that game? Kaiju Brawler Gigabash. Kaiju Bash. Okay. PS5 Kaiju Brawler. Gigabash. Next, a fan favorite fighting game makes a beautiful and bizarre return. Fan favorite fighting game. Beautiful and bizarre return. Not actual gameplay. Is this Persona? <laughs> no. Oh, uh, Jojo. You Jojo fans. It looks like Street Fighter 4. <laughs> Right? <laughs> <My role. laughs> this is the art style Street Fighter 4 wanted it to be. They got assist? Okay. Tag battle? Is this like a, a Marvel vs. Capcom 3 vs. 3? It's showing too much. It's just like a whole bunch of punches with like nothing else. <laughs> JoJo's Bizarre Adventure All Star Battle. Another pass. 50 playable characters. Jesus Christ. Everything's gonna be okay. That is definitely a skip for me. 
Our next two games will take you beyond life and death. God damn! <laughs> next two games will take you beyond life and death. Oh, we've seen this. It's like Delta Tashima, but 2D. What was the game we just had? Shofu? Shofu? Sifu. Sifu. There we go. I said Tofu. So definitely Sifu is not inspired, but 2D Sifu. Make sure it a little bit goes to Tashima. It looks cool. I like the black and white presentation of it. Oh, can you die and come back to life? Isn't that basically go to Tashima? Oh. It looks a little Hitman Lara Croft go ish, if I have to say. Which is kind of weird to say. You know what I'm saying? For a game that looks this beautiful. Bro, you can rewind time. What's going on? No hard dates. I, I guess we're going to get press releases with hard dates. But a lot of the 2022 stuff, I'm surprised that we're not seeing hard dates. Trapped Sony? In an endless cycle. Oh. Fighting. Um. Dying. Returning. Returnal. There we go. <laughs> always the same. Yet always changing. And we're getting DLC. Astra. I'm not alone. Not anymore. Two players. Whoa. Okay. All right. Oh my God. Is that a lightsaber? Now I stand before the endless tower. I climb as Sisyphus did, pushing the boulder upward. No matter how high I climb. The challenge begins again. Oh my god. Ooh. But I fight on through the infinite. Through the infinite. Seeking answers. Seeking ascension. Ascension. My release is within this tower. And I will find it. Let's go. Returnal 3.0 update. So it's not a DLC. Is bringing campaign co-op and a mysterious new survival campaign mode to Returnal Ascension. A free update hitting this March. Free update. W. It's almost time to sign off, but before we do, let's get a first look at two brand new games coming from Square Enix. Two brand new games come from Square Enix. We're getting Triangle Strategy. Is this really what you want? On PlayStation? Yes. I hope we get to see Final Fantasy. Uh, it made me wonder. Seven too. Am I still that same person? No. Oh, well, Final Fantasy the sixteen. Continent. No. Mm -mm. We are to eradicate every last Imperial who comes ashore. Keep focused. <laughs> come on, everyone. Okay. And now. Um. Do you really have such a yearning for war? Mm. I can't comprehend it. Looks like a brand new IP. It doesn't look like it's tied to anything. Woo! This is our chance while they're all assembled. We should send our best and crush them. So that's a no for me. <laughs> that's a no. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> Square Enix. Yeah, this is 16. Right? No. It looks cartoon shall shade it. A little bit. In an unjust world, if what would you choose? Still lingers within you, what is this? Dragon Quest? What? Okay. Doesn't look like Dragon Quest. Valkyrie, heed my words. Ragnarok tears our world asunder. All we hold precious lies on the brink of annihilation. What is this? Become my tool of intervention. No. And save this world from doom. It's like you're highlighting a game and showing you people open up chests and breaking boxes and boss stun on the ground. Like, 
You know? This is a miss for me. And they're ending with this. Emotional damn it! Your efforts to remain undetected are lacking. Bro, what? Reveal yourself. Who are you? Who are you? No one knows. I'm here to tell you right now. We don't care. Let me tell you. <laughs> right, let me tell you. We don't care. That's all for today. We'll see you soon with another state of play. Bro, what? Sometimes I find it hard to believe that PlayStation or, you know, anybody that's going through the stuff. I mean, that, that trailer and thought it was okay to end the say to play with that. Like, what? <gasps> what in the world is going on? This state of play was very mid. It started off okay, not terribly bad, but it just started going downhill. I don't know what was it. Maybe the Gundam? just started going downhill and it never recovered i'm trying to think of anything i remember from this state of play that was that was a bang we got this like not dino crisis set in the future horde dinosaur fighting game which was not what i was expecting from capcom at the same time something that kind of fits their weirdness did that set the world on fire or did that set me on fire or hypeness up no if anything it it deflated it. I was like, all right, we're not getting Resident Evil a little bit because I did think that maybe they started the show. They were going to end it, but that was not the case. Seeing Ghostwire Tokyo was another letdown because that game is like coming out like a few couple of weeks. I figured that it was going to be here again. We got a big like premiere launch trailer for it that I felt like didn't need to be here. It looks cool if you if you're a, a, you know in that niche that wants this type of game. I I'm, I'm just not that's just not for me. The same thing with this with this Final Fantasy of uh, action PlayStation 2 style Devil May Cry fighting like no, no, not for me. And then for Spoken, which is one that just got delayed, so I understand with them like probably having this up to show and then and getting pushed back. It's kind of unfortunate. This is another one that looks dope as fuck. It's kind of in that same camp for me with um with Elden Ring, where it looks dope as fuck. I want to try it, but I'm just not too into these like explore yourself, you know, un story built games. I kind of like Skyrim because it had that core story that kind of pulled you through everything. I feel like this is going to have a stronger story than Elden Ring, but Elden Ring, from what I'm hearing, doesn't really have a core like story there is a story going on but you have to like connect the dots with everything that's going on in the world you have to unravel the story yourself and read a lot of text dialogue and stuff like that i'm not down for that shit but this looks more of a story it's square enix so it's definitely gonna have like quote unquote that story core to it like every final fantasy game but uh I don't know. I, I need to see NPCs. I need to see towns. I need to see like, you know what I'm saying? I need to see the world living. I don't want to just see monsters, creatures roaming around this empty fucking landscape and just fighting it. I just, I don't know. It's just not, it's not calling me. You know what I'm saying? And then we moved into what I call the downfall of this state of play, which was the Gundam fucking trailer. This trailer looked terrible. Extremely terrible. <laughs> Let's just leave it at that because I'm pretty sure people was going to like that. The only one game that I didn't mind at all that I would probably buy is this um Turtles collection, which has Tournament Fighters, which is one of my favorite um Ninja Turtle games of all time. That fighting game. I don't know if it was just one um fighting game or it's a multiple fighting game. I remember playing this, I think on the Sega Genesis, I want to say. Well, probably the Super Nintendo playing that um fighting game over and over again. Then we moved on to quickly this uh again uninspired like Giga Bash, which again looked like they 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 were like, yo, if you're gonna come, we're gonna just shoehorn you in and just like you know, you need you had like 14 seconds and that's all they gave them, like a 15 second trailer. Then they said, Oh, we're gonna show you a fan favorite fighting game, got me hyped. Thinking I was gonna see more of a Skycom, some Street Fighter. They gave us JoJo Bizarre Adventure All Star Battle, which again, if you like JoJo, that's good for you, but wasn't hitting for me. And then we got this Sifu clone. You know, I don't want to say Sifu. It's not Sifu clone, but it's definitely Sifu S 2D 
what mixed with Ghost of Tsushima. It looks cool. It has a vibe, but again, it's not pulling at my strings telling me to buy. And then we got the Returnal 3.0 DLC update, which to me is fire. They're adding two players. I think that's pretty cool. Survival mode, that's there's nothing bad to say there. It's just more Returnal, which is, and it's also free. So that's, you can't complain about that at all. And then we got the last two Square Enix titles. Again, we got like this tactical, you know, Fire Emblem S style. Not for me. Let's just leave it at that, right? And then we got another, like, I don't want to say, oh, this is like a action adventure game that looks very, like, it was on the drawing board to come out for the PS2. And they were like, oh, we could just, you know, finish that game and bang it out real quick. And that's what they did. <laughs> this looks like a ps2 game that got forgotten on the drawing room table that they had basically all the art and assets done completed but they never finished and they was like oh let's just polish it up and put it out you know what i'm saying and that's what we have here and that's what they end the state of play with and it's kind it's quite a quite a weird mixed bag now that's gonna be it for my live reaction review of this state of play let me know what you think about it in the comment section below like always guys i answer all comments so let's have that conversation down there if you've seen any game that you think that i should cover on the channel do more dope videos about let me know in the comments and let's chat it up about what exactly we've seen let me know what the score you will give this as well in the comments i'm kind of mid with this below mid with this state of play if i had to give it a grade i would give it a three out of five the only thing that's saving this stuff is the returnal update as well as the turtles and time stuff but besides that the, the ninja turtle collection i said turtles and time but that was part of that was part of the collection but the turtles and that that's part of the it that's the only thing that saved this state of play for me let me know what you will score this state of play in the comment section below like always guys i'm daddy gamer fred Peace. I love you. I'm going to see you guys.